Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to disable this snipping tool in Windows 10. Let's start it up real quick. Allows you to take screenshots. Actually, a really good tool. So why you'd want to disable it, I don't know. People keep asking me, but I guess I can only answer you with because you can. You have to do this with Group Policy Editor, or you're going to have to do it with the registry. So we're going to open up Group Policy Editor. If you don't have it, you can follow this link right here. Windows 10 home users do not have Group Policy Editor, and we have a video for that as well. Windows Key Plus R. I had to think about it for a second there. Mondays. gpedit.msc. gpedit.msc. Press OK. And we're going to follow through to scroll this down. Computer configuration. Administrative templates. Windows components. Tablet PC. Accessories. We're going to double click on do not allow snipping tool to run. And with all group policy editor items, you will find that it is explained right here. So not configured is almost always a default. That means it's going to run with however Windows expects it to run. Enabled is actually disabled. And obviously, that means that disable means it's enabled. So typically, you end up sticking between not configured and one of these two. In this case, click it to enabled, and it won't work anymore. Let's see, we might need to reboot. Let me see. There you go. And to re-enable it, as I mentioned, we'll just go back to not configured. There you go. Piece of cake. Now, if you don't have Group Policy Editor, you can do it in the registry. A little more complicated because every registry is going to be a little different, but most of yours should look like this. So back up your registry if you need be. Press the Windows key plus R and type in R-E-G, E-D-I-T, and press Enter or click OK. So we're going to jump to two different locations, and you may not have everything here so I will show you what I mean you might not have the tablet PC registry entry oops as you can see it didn't go there so we don't have a tablet PC so control V take out the tablet PC bit there you go so your H key current user software policies Microsoft that means we're gonna need a new key we'd have to right click new key and we would call it tablet PC now we're gonna do a new D word 32-bit value we're gonna highlight this code right here and check for the little eye up here in the video or the video description for a link to follow this tutorial so we're gonna come over into the right side with tablet PC highlighted we're gonna do a new D word 32-bit value copy and paste or type in disable snipping tool and let's take a look here we're going to change the value data to one right there comes up highlighted click OK and now it's disabled now we need to repeat those steps in a second key that's why it's a little more difficult we're going to go here HK Local Machine Software Policies Microsoft. Once again, follow the steps I just showed you. Create the tablet PC key, create the D word dis disable snipping tool, and change the value data to one. Now, let's say you change your mind. You have two choices. As you know, we created the tablet PC. If you think you might change your mind back and forth, just double click this and change it to a zero again. That way you can always come back and switch back and forth. However, for the most part, you either want it or you don't. So if you change your mind, I would come all the way down to the tablet PC, right click and delete it. Or it wouldn't matter much, you can delete the disable snipping tool D word that you created. Right click over here to show you and delete. As always, when you're playing with a registry, please back it up. Follow this link here on how to back up or restore your registry. It's easy to do. Once again, at the bottom of the tutorial in the description, you can find that link. 
There you have it. Bottom right corner, Major Geeks logo. Click on there to subscribe. Click like if you like. And uh, thanks for watching as always. See ya.